All right, y'all, welcome back to Philly D's Garage. We got the G35 in here today. Um, now, the reason why it's in here today is because it's making this rattle. Now, I've fixed this rattle before, a long time ago, but that was one side. Now, the other side is making the same noise. So, let me just show y'all what I'm talking about. The Cadillac converters, uh, they have a shield on them that over time it starts to break. Now, I don't already started uh, uh, taking it out, but I was like, you know what? Let me just show these guys what I'm hearing and possibly what you guys could be hearing too. So you might be having the same uh, issue on your car. Let me get these lights situated. So basically. Um, I should have had these lights already situated, right? So, basically, this is the heat shield right here that goes up over your Cadillac converter. So, over time, these little spot wells on here, they break, and then your Cadillac converter start just rattling. Um, so you may or may not hear that. If you do hear something rattling up under your car, um, get up under there and check your heat shields up underneath your car now not every car has these um but these particular g35s uh do have them now if you can look over here at my other one over there as you can see right here i already took that shield off so at that time when i took that shield off this one wasn't making a noise so you know i'd rather have it there because the factory had it there so i left it alone but now it's rattling I'm taking it off. So the Cadillac converter be totally fine. I think this is the only car I got that got a fucking heat shield over it. But um, so yeah, basically, um, I was started to let y'all hear, but I didn't already kind of started taking it apart, so I don't want it to sound worse than it did. But basically, it's just it's just a little rattle. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this the rest of the way off. But should have had it before and after. But yeah, you just keep breaking it up along the line of the pinch weld and it's just gonna crack loose just like that and just peel it off it's gonna be a pain in the ass it's much better um it's way better than being on a uh, on a floor much better if you had a lift um but yeah just get up under there with a pry bar pry that back um and that's what it is so i'm gonna finish getting it off so yeah, man, quick video. Just wanted to show y'all, if you got a G35 that's making a rattle noise, maybe you should check your catalytic converter uh, heat shield. More than likely, that's probably what it is. Um, so yeah, man, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll check y'all on the next one. All right, y'all, a little bit of bonus footage. So this is the shield from around the catalytic converter, as you can see. So like I told y'all, it's easier to get this off when it's up on a lift, but I'm on a floor, so I ended up using my anger saw, uh, air sawzall here to cut. I only really cut a piece of it off, and then the rest I was ready, but I was able to uh, pry it out with the pry bar. So let me show y'all what it looked like real quick. Get up under here. I got the lights on already. So here it is. This is what it looks like. With the shield off. Not gonna happen to your color converter. It's just the factory thing that they do. You know, block some of the heat from getting around your transmission. I mean, they do it for a reason, but once it's rattling, there's nothing else you can do. So this is the side that I bend it. And this is the passenger side right here so that shield runs from right here to all the way up there let me see if i can show you guys see where that flange is at right there that flange that shield runs up to there all the way down in here so that's a big shield to get off man i was up under here for a minute um if you guys want to be up under here make sure 
y'all got uh, eye protection because, man, I got a couple bruises, a couple smashed fingers, and a couple things in my eyes too, y'all. <laughs> so yeah, man, a little bit of bonus for this. Just thought I'd share that with y'all. I hear a rattle. This is probably what it is. So if you tackle this job, just take your time, get it done. Then your car be noise free once again. Check you on the next one.